For the 20th consecutive year, Elmwood hosted the annual swearing-in ceremony for their We Deliver program. The program allows students to learn what it's like working to operate a post office. The program helps build skills, teamwork ability, as well as other applicable experiences which relate to the real world. Principal Ann Carver explained the program at the ceremony. So today is a We Deliver ceremony, a swearing-in ceremony. As I've already said, has a 20-year tradition, and it's off, this program is offered in other areas, I believe, around the country. Uh, it's not specific to Elmwood School, but it's something that we've been doing here for a long time. And there's a pretty rigorous process to be a part of um, the postmaster position. So I, standing beside me uh, is Carl Sagami, who's the postmaster in Hopkinton, and we mimic our procedures a little bit uh, after the, um, the procedures that happen in real life. And so if you decide you're in third grade and you decide you want to be a postmaster, this is what happens. You, mostly what happens. You indicate to your families that you'd like to be considered for postmaster, and we set aside a day. This happened right before Thanksgiving. Come on. And everyone who got scored a perfect score on the written test was advanced to the next stage of our procedure. So then folks came back um, on a second day to write an essay. And the title of their essay for kids who scored 100% was Why I'd Make a Good Postmaster for the We Deliver program. And um, so students submit their essay to the office. We take the names off the essay because we do not want to be swayed by um, knowing who wrote what. And then we share the essay with volunteers, staff members who volunteer to read the essays. And they get sort of ranked one through, depending on how many kids, I think nine children um, scored a per perfect score this year. So the essays are ranked and the top four are chosen as um, postmasters. Hopkinton postmaster Carl Zagami swore in the postmasters as well as the rest of the student participants in the program. Enzo Approach, Acadia King, Maggie Flynn, What's your role at the uh, post office again? The post office. I'm the postmaster for both offices, the Woodville and the Hopkins and post office. Okay, what uh, were you doing here today at Elmwood? Today we were doing celebrating the 20th uh, installation of postmasters and the uh, fellow crew of the little post office at the We Deliver program that they have at the Elmwood School. And for those that don't know, what does a postmaster do? Postmaster is a jack of all trades. Today I was actually out delivering, uh, but most of the time it's it's keeping the flow and making sure everybody comes to work, delivers all the mail that comes into the town, um, and that my crew comes home, goes home safely on a daily basis, um, and basically servicing the public in, in the Hopkinton town. And how do you like this uh, We Deliver program? It must be a, a good thing for the kids to really learn a lot about the uh, post office industry. It is, especially with the letters, everyone's been doing so much on email. It's nice that, you know, I'm sure when a grandmother or a grandfather mother or father still get that personalized card whether it's a birthday card holiday card 
uh, even the sympathy cards, it means a lot to people and it's nice to see that old handwritten, you know, stationary items that are still going out throughout the Postal Service and things like that. And do you work with the kids to kind of show them what to do as well? I've come in a few times. I actually have seen how they do the operation and it's run just like the older days when there was less automation. Now the Postal Service is more automated, so more things are done by machines. But the kids are actually doing it the way it was way back when, over 100, 200 years ago when the mail system, you know, was going strong and everything was done handwritten and sorted by hand, by train, you know, moved by train, and nowadays it's boats, planes. And I'm imagining with the holidays approaching, this must be a pretty busy time at the post office. Very busy this time of year. Right now is the parcel delivery, so I just ask people to be aware of, you know, if they know there's packages coming, just to be aware that they are out there and to make sure, you know, if there's any issues, please contact us at the post office. Uh, the phone number there is 508-435-8787. All right, thank you very much.